Members of the jury, distinguished authorities, ladies and gentlemen, I would like to thank the BBVA Foundation for this very generous award and the jury for selecting me. It's an incredible honour to get an award that has previously gone to legendary figures such as Donald Knuth, Marvin Minsky, Carver Mead and Stephen Cook. I would also like to thank my wife who made my career possible. For over 50 years, there was a battle between two visions of artificial intelligence. The classical view inspired by logic was that intelligence was all about reasoning and that to make systems that reason sensibly in the real world, we would need to enter a very large number of facts by hand and also enter a large number of rules of inference and heuristics for when they should be applied. The rival view was that we should look to biology and try to mimic the neural networks of the brain. In particular, we should focus on how these networks learn from experience so that we would not have to specify all the knowledge by hand. The neural network approach was regarded as a ridiculous fantasy by most people in AI, even though both Turing and von Neumann believed that it was the most promising path. I started working on neural networks in 1970 and it was many years before I could get them to learn even very simple things. Back then, the idea that a network with a billion adaptive connections and no prior knowledge would be able to learn to translate strings of Chinese words into strings of English words just from looking at examples seemed utterly preposterous. But now it works. I've been extremely fortunate to work with some very talented graduate students and postdocs. And in 2009, Two of my graduate students, George Dahl and Abdul Rahman Mohammed, showed that a new learning algorithm that I've been working on was actually better than the existing technology at speech recognition. Now all the best speech recognition systems use neural networks. Three years later, two more of my brilliant graduate students, Ilya Sutskova and Alex Krzyzewski, showed that a type of neural network that had been introduced by my former postdoc, Jan Lacan, worked much better than existing computer vision systems at recognizing objects and images. Their work revolutionized computer vision and neural networks were finally accepted as the right way to solve many of the problems that had defeated classical AI. I think the moral of my career is very simple. Get yourself some very good graduate students. Thank you.